Welcome to this tutorial in which we are going to discuss about slicers in Excel and how they can supercharge your data analysis. In this tutorial, we will learn how to add slicers to our big data to filter by different indicators, making our analysis more dynamic and insightful than ever before. Slicers are interactive visual controls that allow us to filter data dynamically. Here we have a data set containing 23 columns and 9000 plus records. We can use the slicers to filter our sales data based on specific segments, regions or categories helping us identify trends and insights. Select the table, convert the selected range into table. Just press Ctrl plus T and click OK. Remove filter button from here go to insert slicer and click it so here we have a list select segments regions and categories and click ok so here we have three slicer pop-ups Select the pop-ups, convert into columns, resize it and adjust at the relevant place. We place category to right side, segment to the left side. regions into the center so convert this region into the four columns resize it and adjust within center we can adjust the appearance and layout of our slicer to fit our preference and make them more visually appealing now we can change its color category to orange regions to green and segments to dark blue color you can align all of the three pop-ups from here now click on each part of the segment and filter relevant result we can unfilter the results from here Similarly, we can filter results for regions and categories as well. We can apply three filters at same time also. Select consumer from segment, east, region and technology category. Look, relevant data for three conditions have been filtered. We can see which segment, regions or categories are performing well and which one may need more attention. So with slicers, our analysis become more dynamic and interactive, empowering us to make data-driven decisions with confidence. And there you have it. By adding slicers to our sales big data, we have unlocked a whole new level of data analysis and visualization i hope you found this tutorial helpful don't forget to like share and subscribe for more excel tips and tricks thanks for watching and happy analyzing